Producing materials creates a huge amount of carbon dioxide every year. Construction is an area where we use a huge amount of material, and therefore we have huge scope to reduce the amount of carbon dioxide we use if we can reduce the demand for new construction material. Construction materials have a huge advantage over other industries in that construction materials, most of the time, are ready to reuse at the end of life. So if we can reuse more material, therefore we don't need to produce as much new material, and therefore we can reduce carbon dioxide emissions. So buildings use a huge amount of material, and when a building comes to, to an end of its life, uh, we knock it down. And even though the pieces in it are all perfectly fine, um, the beams uh, could be reused, but because it's cheaper, we knock everything down and we recycle the steel, and we crush up the concrete. This is particularly true when we have composite construction. So composite construction is where we tie the steel and the concrete together in a way that allows us to use the strength of both materials. So it gives us a more efficient design. However, the way we tie it together is we weld a stud onto the steel that sticks into the concrete. And this makes it impossible to reuse um, the materials after life, that we can't get them down without damaging both very severely. So when we discovered this, uh, we thought, is there a way we can design a beam that allows it to be taken apart at the end of life, disassembled, and therefore we can reuse it? We made up three beams, each of which had a steel beam underneath and a concrete slab on the top. And we connected those beams together, not using welded studs, but using bolts. And we tested each of those beams, and then we unloaded it and took it apart. We then put the beams back together to show that everything was still okay and then loaded it up to failure, so we broke them. That shows that the, the demountable studs, the reusable design, gives us the benefit and the same performance as welded studs, but also gives us, gives us an additional benefit of being able to be reused. So if you think about um, beams in buildings, they're very much like a mechano set. We, we only use a certain amount of sizes. We tend to make similar kind of buildings everywhere in the world. So ideally, we would have some kind of kind of giant mechano set that we would just move the pieces around and make different buildings using the same pieces and changing them very, very slightly. But that's only possible if we're able to get the pieces out of the building at the end of life without damaging them. So we're collaborating with the two other researchers in this field. Um, at least one of them sits on um, the committee which drafts the rules for how you design buildings. There's kind of a, um, a set of guidelines they have to follow to make sure the building is safe. Um, currently, those codes are written only assuming you're using the welded studs, the non-reusable studs. Um, however, he's looking to change it so that it will allow you to use the demountable studs. So the idea of using bolted studs has been discussed before, and we found a few references to, to an idea, but it has never been tested before. It is, no one has ever proved that it can be done, it can be safely demounted, and it um, ma matches the performance of welded studs, ultimately. That's what we've proved, yeah.